Aston Martin DB9 has been on sale now since 2003, which is pretty hard to believe. Time it was replaced, probably? Yep. And the DB11 is that car. There is no DB10 because that's the car that James Bond will be driving in Spectre. The DB11 gets a turbocharged AMG engine, which we've seen driving around the Nürburgring. And now the mules are out wearing less disguise than before. And it looks pretty cool. Very Aston, but a lot more aggressive. Nissan Skyline prices are on the rise. If you've always wanted an R32 Skyline, then you are not alone. And you best be quick, as prices are climbing fast. The 25-year import rule in America means that R32s are now in the sights of the American Gran Turismo generation thus far denied JDM Exotica. Japanese importers are wising up to sending their stock east instead of west, so if you want one, you best do it quick before they all end up stateside. The Vool 05 is basically a Mexican version of the Xenos that we featured last series. It's a bit more expensive. OK, it's a lot more expensive. It costs twice as much. It's got the same engine, it's got a bit more carbon fibre and it looks a whole lot fancier. Is it worth the extra money? Well, when we've driven it, we'll let you know. <laughs> 